Nutella stuffed pancakes. <sighs> I'm starting to wobble. Oh. Nutella stuffed. Right, so it's pancake day. Oh, I love that sound. On Hang Tuesday. On. You've got to do it with a spoon. Oh, yeah. Nope. Okay. Oh. Hit the wrong bit. What do you mean? It's got to be just the sound of it. What do you mean I hit the wrong bit? I hit exactly the right bit. So I have greased um, a baking tray and lined it. And I've just put a little bit of oil on this spoon as well to help the Nutella oh. Oh, so slip off. off. Because mm -hmm. what we are going to do is make Nutella discs. I'm going to make it might be a bit too much. One sec. I just need to get another spoon. Make the think, Nutella Gigi? discs. Freeze them. And then put them inside our pancakes. Mm -hmm. So that when we cook our pancakes, they don't run everywhere. They start to melt. And then when we cut them open, we have... Lovely gooey. Nutella. Oh, the smell. I must say, I used to just put my Nutella in and then cover it with a bit of pancake butter, but I saw this on, I don't know, Flip Flop or TikTok or whatever it was. Flip Flop? That's going to be a lot of Nutella in the pancake. Do you like this idea, Mark? I really like this idea. Flip Flop, TikTok. What I should have done was do four blobs and then smooth yeah, you've them. you kind of put them in the oddest place. I have. Well, I don't even know if this is going to work. It's really bizarre. Right? I know, because I didn't really... Do you know what? I wasn't thinking about what I was doing. Well, that's stupid. Yeah, but it's fine. It's going to be fine. They're not going to cook, so they're not going to spread. They're just going to go into the freezer <clears throat> till they're frozen. I can't tell you how long that will take because it depends how cold your freezer is. Because your freezer might be colder than my freezer. Or your freezer might be warmer than my freezer. I don't know. Chi Chi. Chi Chi. That is now going in the freezer. See you later. Okay, so our Nutella is freezing. The dog's very excited. She's just bought me a toy. She thinks if she brings me a toy, I'm going to give her Nutella pancakes. Not good for you. So I've got 300 grams of plain flour and to it I'm going to add um, a teaspoon of baking powder and half a teaspoon of bicarb. I think those two raising agents together help us get the fluffy, fluffy, puffy. Pardon? Fluffy, puffy, puffy, want fluffy pancakes. Half a tablespoon, half a teaspoon of bicarb. Right, I've got 300 mils of full fat milk. Now, I would like it to be buttermilk, but whoever has buttermilk in the fridge. So what I'm going to do is add a tablespoon of vinegar mm. to my milk, and then that will be as if it was buttermilk. Don't worry, because it will curdle a bit, but it's that acidity working with the um, raising agents that gives us the fluffiness. So I'm just going to give that a little stir. So we've got all those mixed up. Okay, now, one egg. Oh no, is that someone at the door? What should we do? Go and get it. Wait there. Cute babs. I was just filming the eggs. Okay, so one egg. One luscious, lovely egg. Do you wash your hands after touching an egg? No. Um, and to that, I'm going to add my milk. Look, at see, it's a bit lumpy now. And you yeah. might go, ugh, but that's what we want. Is it? Yeah. All right, okay. So now I'm going to add a pinch of salt. You could add now some caster sugar, but I'm not going to do that because we've got all that Nutella. So, oh, I know what I forgot. Two tablespoons of melted butter and that really does make a difference i might just pour that back in the jug Et voila and i'm going to make a well in the middle of my flour and then i'm going to put it in now really important that you don't over 
mix your your mixture because that's what can give you sort of a flat sort of heavy pancake how do you know well i'm going to show you so if it's a little bit lumpy a bit like when you make a muffin if you over mix your oh look how that's already fizzing up so beautifully now why a lot of people's fluffy pancakes don't fluff up and don't rise enough is because baking powder only lasts about nine months to a year max so if you want to test if your baking powder and your bicarb is still alive just put a little spoonful in some water and if it fizzes up straight away it's safe if not you need to be, buy more right the other thing so you see how it's just a little bit lumpy that's fine so now i'm going to leave that for half an hour so it activates so hopefully our nutella will be frozen and then we can make nice naughty pancakes oh look we could just eat it like that couldn't we yes bars of nutella let me add them okay so we've got a little we've got our butter left from our uh i melted 40 grams and put two tablespoons didn't i okay so look at that lovely and fluffy you can see the bubbles look at that that's what we want bubble bubble -tastic. so we put in our first layer and that will pop up nicely Oh, yeah. I'm just going to let it cook a little. So you want a medium heat. What is a medium heat? Medium heat. Not too high, not too low, because you want the... See how those... See how we're starting to get the little holy bits? Yes. Right, now I'm going to put the Nutella on top. Mmm. Mmm. Do you not do mm. both sides of the pancake? Hang on, oh. I'm going to. Get a smaller scoop up. The food is the star. Ooh. And then seal over the pancake. Ah. So that when we flip it. It's like a flying saucer. Uh -huh. So that's going to cook for a minute or two. So come back. See you in a minute. Right, we're ready to flip. Woo! Okay, so we'll just let that cook now for a minute. It's about a minute on one side. Again, it depends on the thickness. A minute and then maybe 40 seconds on the other side. Oh, look how nice and fluffy that is and thick. It's going to be divine. Okay, that's nice. Looks nice and thick. Oh, you can just see that Nutella starting to ooze out. So I'm going to do a stack, so come back in a couple of minutes. Okay, there's our last one. I was going to do more, but I think it's going to start looking obscene, isn't it? Is that your stomach making that noise? No. It's the kid's TikTok. It's the flip-flop. He has been trying to get hold of this the entire time. Whenever you haven't, we haven't been filming, he's been hiding the Nutella jar. So I think we need a little scoop of extra oh, Nutella. Just the like girls that. This. I don't think they want any. I think he does. I don't think so. Okay, so then. No. Some cream. Oh my god, it's in the microphone. <laughs> Sorry, microphone. It's alright, keep filming. Nuts, hazelnuts, because that's what's in Nutella. Chopped, roasted hazelnuts. What do you think? The teacher loves this, I this bit. Oh, and nice. a little sprinkle. Oh. Of icing sugar. Ooh. Okay, now I think we need to cut into it. What do you think? I do. Look at that oozy Nutella. Ready? Yeah. Camera ready? Mm. Oh. 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 Oh, hang on, let me get it out. Hang on. <laughs> 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 Oh my god, I cut it! Yeah. I should have got a better knife. 
It's not very Instagram, was it? Okay, have a look in there. Have a look in there. Because I can't. I've got to put this over here. It's like a Nutella pancake cake. Mmm, look at that, guys. Yum. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Mmm!